Hi YouTube. So today's um, flats and hand challenge prompt no, is um, what's your favourite flat fold? So um, yeah, I'm just going to get into it. Um, it's a bit stiff from hand washing to be honest. Um, so my most used um, ever um like not just during the flats challenge but normal the the is the pad fold so you just fold it into quarters and then fold it into thirds and you get the pad fold um i would normally use that in a pocket or in a cover um um, yeah, for the challenge, it's been her nap time nappy, just pad folded in the cover because she doesn't need as much, like, um, faff. <laughs> like, it's not, she doesn't need it to be so complicated for her nap time. Um, sorry about my partner, he's playing a game on the computer. Um, and the other fold that I've been doing for this challenge yeah, right, and that I have done when she's been poorly before um, is the origami fold where you fold into a quarter and then you take one of the corners and pull it out so it looks like that and then you flip it and you fold the square bit into the middle nice gone a bit wonky because the flat's not flat um, and then it looks like that and you pull that bit up wrap it round put a snappy or a pin on it um, um, that's a good one um, for um, when she's been poorly or um, or if I'm using these flats in particular for um, night time and then I'll put another flat um, pad folded on top um, but with the towel that I've been using for night time um, this week um, I've been picking and folding that because um, it's bigger so when I origami fold it it just doesn't fit right um, so I have to pick and fold it so that I can fold the flaps in more. I'll show you what I mean in a sec. So with pick and fold, you lie it flat. Um, so you lie it flat, then you pull one corner in and pull it back a bit. And then you um, do the same with that side. It's going to be a bit wonky because I can't do it very well with one hand and then for the rise you can pull these bits in as far as you need to and then you fold it in half and that is your Pikmin fold right there but um, she doesn't with this um, flat in particular she doesn't really need it um, these ends folding up too much um, just enough to hide the point are. really um, and that would fit her like that um, but I only use the Pikmin fold yeah, with yeah, the um, the modified bath towel at the moment um, with these flats the muslin flats I mainly use the origami fold because it's um, to know it just fits better um, and then um, so yeah overall my favorite is the pad fold because it's easy but um, on the basis of more complicated flat um, flat folds I'd say the origami fold um, because it makes less bulk at the back I think I think the Pikmin fold makes a lot of bulk at the back um, kite fold is no good on on her so I don't think there's enough absorbency in the middle 
Um, and she doesn't really need all that containment because she doesn't have loose poos anymore. Um, so yeah, for, I mean, she's nearly three and basically potty trained. So all she needs really is just a lot of pee absorbency. Yeah, <laughs> that's, yeah, that's the answer to my day three of the flats challenge prompt. Um, sorry, I got a bit distracted because there's a magpie on my roof and I'm, I'm not best friends with him. <laughs> He's always chucking bits of whatever into my garden and my yard and it's really annoying. Um, yeah, anyway, that is that and I will see you tomorrow for the next prompt. Um, and thank you for watching and I'll see you tomorrow, bye.